The enemy is the COVID, the, mic, the microbes. Eh, parang maawa ako. I do not, please do not misunderstand me. I am making it clear now. I do not want you to go there and come back in a coffin. That's my that's my only argument, if you may, because you are Filipinos. At mahal ko ang mga buhay ng kababayan ko. The COVID is here to stay. Yung mga big business, uh, let me tell you something. Meron tayong mga problema noon which was really part of governance and which I hope you'd understand that it was really part of my sworn duty as a, the, as an employee of the government uh, who heads the executive department. Words were uh, well, uh, mainly mine but uh, if you just can forget it uh, for the moment I'd like to thank you from the bottom of my heart for helping us, helping us, uh, you know, provide the necessities of the moment. Uh, uh, we, we can, uh, I, I can promise you that uh, I'll be nice uh, and uh, if you want to see me, we can talk and naubos na ho yung pagkasuplado ko kasi dahil sa the COVID the COVID, the COVID humbled me that uh, with the kind of uh, response that uh, you gave uh, showed to the public uh, it's a humbling experience also for me that uh, you know baka kailangan mo rin sila balang araw so maybe uh, there will be a lot of uh, legal issues, but we can talk. I am, am ready to talk. Uh, and I'd be reasonable. Uh, yung mga masakit kong salita uh, to the Ayalas and to uh, 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 si Pangilinan, uh, I, I apologize for the hurting words. Uh, you can find in your heart to uh, forgive me uh, because uh, if you do not, then I will ask and, and you do not want to forgive me, I will uh, undercut you. I'll go direct to God. God, I don't want to forgive you. I don't want to forgive you. Uh, mga kababayan ko, I hope that uh, I have enlightened you about what we are doing. Lahat ito wala. Itong lahat discussion ito, COVID tapos to protect and save the Filipino. That is all there is to it. Maraming salamat po.